so students uh, my name is sumit mehta and in this lecture we will study about evolution and classification so till far we have discussed about evolution now what is classification student what is classification okay so the classification is characteristics characteristics are details of appearance or behavior or behavior in so we are doing classification now based on characteristics so what are characteristics are the detail of appearance or behavior in other words you can say that in other words a particular form a particular form of a particular function or a particular function so basis on that we will classify the evolutions okay so now we will trace evolutionary relationships so the sub topic in this tracing evolutionary relationships okay students so when we try to when we try to follow evolutionary relationships how do we identify characteristics how do we identify characteristics in different organisms would be in different organisms would be similar because they are means how do we identify characteristics are similar or common you can say in different organisms the characteristics can be similar because they are inherited from a common ancestor means their grand 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 ancestors are common okay so as an example consider the fact that mammals have mammals so this is example have four limbs okay and do as do birds reptiles and amphibians so such a homologous characteristics help us to identify evolutionary relationship so we can say that there is evolutionary relationship between all these okay all these species so this is all about student tracing evolutionary relationships so in the next lecture we will discuss about the evolution by stages so stay tuned for the next lecture on evolution by stages student okay